Hello District 93, this video will show you just how simple it is to compost and improve our recycling efforts. It can be done in four easy steps. Liquids, compost, recycling, and finally, landfill. Remember, you are our greatest resource. Step number one. In the lunchroom, you should empty all leftover liquids into the liquid bucket. This includes your milk and juice. Pretty simple, right? Step number two. Empty all partially eaten food into the compost bin. This may include food you no longer want or have only eaten part of. You can also compost the paper liners from the school lunch trays and any other soiled paper products like a used napkin, greasy pizza box, or the paper fast food bags. Did you know you can also compost our forks and spoons from the lunchroom? Those are compostable. Plasticware that you bring from home should go back home. Step number three. Deposit all recyclable materials into the recycling bin. This may include your empty applesauce container or paper juice box. All plastic items may be recycled except if they are labeled with a six. Number six plastic items sadly cannot be recycled. Step number four. Finally, place the rest of our waste into the landfill bin. This may include your straws, plastic baggies, or wrappers. That's it. These quick and easy steps will help you return valuable resources to our earth. If you get stuck on what goes where, you can always look at the signs on our bins or ask for help. Did you know we also have a sharing table? If you have any wrapped or uneaten purchased food from the lunchroom, you should add it to the sharing table. Now what about snacks? Which are those going to? When you're finishing your snack, you'll place any leftover food products in the green compost container. Check the sign to see what can go inside the green compost container. If you have something in your stock that can be recycled, place it in the blue recycling bins. 